I'm Kelp Talks, and I have found the best money-making methods on the Donut SMP. For the past two weeks, I have experimented and toiled with the best money-making methods. And to prove my achievement, I have over 10 million sold on Slash Sell, getting my multiplier up to 1.9. Before the downfall, I was making 2.8 million a day AFK. So let's get into the rise and fall of my empire. The first method I tried was, of course, sugarcane. It's easy and simple to set up, and it's the best way to start getting your first few dollars. Uh, it sells for a lot, and it's easy to harvest a lot fast. This is by far the best manual farm. If you do not want to build something automatic, I definitely recommend sugarcane. You can make ludicrous amounts of money depending on the size. They're cheap and simple to build, and you know, I just like them, they're fun. My second method was cactus. Now, I don't have much footage from this at the time, but I do have a home at the ruins, and we can explore the size of this cactus farm. Now, this thing is actually huge, and it didn't take me that long to build, and I think this would probably make me uh, 100k every few hours, and that was pre-cactus buff. Now, with the cactus buff, this would probably this would be making me double. So now this method takes a lot more space than the others. So if you're willing to risk it and you're able to defend, I'd say build a cactus farm, especially if it's your first farm, because they're easy to build and cheap to build. In fact, while you're clearing out an area for a solid permanent base, I say use all that cobble deep slate to build up one of these babies. Also, if you make it out of Cobble Deep Slate, it's going to be a lot harder to grief. Cobble Deep Slate uh, blast resistance is higher than most blocks, so combined with the scale, it's actually very difficult to grief the whole thing. The final method I started using, I went all in on. Pumpkin was making me 3 per, and with a multiplier, I got that up to 6 basically. I was making about 17,000 a double chest. And at my peak, I was making 2.8 million a day. And let me tell you, these bases are good investments. These things take forever to find. With the donut anti-cheat, my bases lasted for over two weeks and still were not found. The only reason they were destroyed was because my main account got hacked. And I believe they would have lasted much longer. This is also why I like to stray away from villagers. Villagers also make your base much easier to find. That's why I would not keep your villagers in the same base as your farms. And if you have extra accounts, you can also split your farms into different areas, allowing for fail safes. Let me put into perspective the amount of money this thing generates. 2.8 million a day is, that is two sets an hour if you buy them off AH. And one of these things, making 600K a day, would definitely be satisfactory for most. But you guys have got to hop on the Nona SMP, dude. This is such a fire server, dude. Like, on God, dude. I'm raking in fat stacks, dude. All you have to do is sit here, bro. And look, look at this investment, dude. Now look, dude, if you guys are like sick of like trying to like do the capitalist dream in like real life, dude, like, just hop on the Donut SMP, dude. I pay, I pay employees, dude. I'm running a business over here, dude. You know who got me the resources for this massive machine? Some employees, dude. I pay them 10k. I'm like, all right, I need a shulker of this, dude. And they, and they get it for me, dude. All right, you just gotta pay them, dude. You just gotta pay them. And guess what? Guess what? Guess what? Not only is this thing making me fat stacks, probably like 500k a day. I am, in fact, building another one, dude. Another one, dude. I am about to be the richest, but I want to. I want to give you like some reference, like for how difficult it is to like to create something like this. Like this is no like minor feat. All right. Like we're gonna like you have to sit here and witness what it's like to mine a quarter of this thing out. All right. Look, look at this. If we have tough, it goes a little bit faster. But like, this is how long it takes me. To mine up the entire thing. This is ridiculous. We're gonna go like a quarter of the ways. Look at that. I did that distance in that amount of time. And I have to go all the way back, dude. That is crazy. And I'm going down 15 layers down to here. But like fat stacks do not lie, dude. Like, look at this balance, dude. 
Look at this bounce. I've been giving money out, dude. I'm like the Mr. Beast of the Donut SMP. So that is all of my money making methods. And don't worry, I'm going to be making more content. I'm finally getting good at Crystal PvP and I'm working on new farms. I'm starting from the ground up and the next video will be an absolute banger. So subscribe and like if you want to see more videos on how to get fat stacks on the Donut SMP. Thanks for watching. Kelp out.